I had no idea I was going to win or win a prize or to get to the final because you can never tell with any competitions because it's so subjective. And sometimes you play your best and you're out after the first round. And sometimes you don't play so well and you win a prize. I just remember I was very, very focused for three weeks. We were living in Tao Hotel and we had the, our little uh, upright candles in the, in the room and people were practicing all day long. It was like from, from everywhere. The second prize, of course, it was more like uh, I wondered what happened. I could feel it in the audience as well. So I guess it's a decision um, by the jury, but I can just say that we all tried our very best. I have been going on tours after the Yushan competition and going back to my home country and where I'm treated sort of like a classical music idol. Mm. When I was about 14, 15, I went to the United States and I lived with my sister who is two years older than me, so the two of us actually started living in a foreign land by ourselves. I ended up going to the Juilliard School, but that's uh, just the next step in my music study career. There was no way that I could have devoted myself to music if I stayed in Taiwan. So. But now I go back and of course it's a very different city, it's very modern and lots of new things happening. I would say I feel international. I, I don't feel very much I am Taiwanese or I'm American, but I feel I'm, I'm a musician. Yeah, actually, people, people say that about my playing, but it really is open, uh, slightly cracked. I, yeah, I, I see, I see the keys, yeah.